Thank you, Byron. Um, obviously, Rick Eckstein. Um, glad to have you here, man. I, it's uh, it's a joy to watch you work, Rick. And I, I think you got something to say first. Yeah, I'd like to wish my mother Patricia and my two sisters Christine and Susan a happy Mother's Day. Very, very smart man, right there. Very smart man. Um, really happy Mother's Day to all you mothers out there. I mean, it's a special day for all of us. And hey. Um, this ball club, you come over here last year. Um, offense did a pretty good job, but let's talk about the depth of this lineup and, and how it has improved over the winter. Yeah, you know, with the uh, acquisition of Yvonne Rodriguez and, and Adam Kennedy, um, the emergence of Ian Desmond, um, you know, and veteran guys like Willie Tavares, you know, I, I think they all bring a certain aspect to the table that allows us to be uh, much more flexible. You know, the, the at bats that AK and Pudge have given so far this season have been great, outstanding, tough, tough at bats. You know, they're tough outs. And then Jim has the ability to, uh, you know, put AK over at first to play defense late. Put Willie Tavares out in the outfield who had a cannon for an arm, mm -hmm. you know, and, and we defend the field so much better this year, and uh, and I think that's been a, a huge attribute to the, the start of our season. Your hitting philosophy uh, more mental, mechanical, or. Um just individual? It's an individualistic approach. I mean, obviously at this level, there's a, a lot of the mentality uh, is what we really talk about. Um, you do work at the physical aspects of, of a person's swing and making sure they're getting into a good hitting position and, and uh, you know, executing a good swing. But uh, to have a plan and develop that mentality and then go out and, and have the confidence in that plan to execute is what we really try to uh, day in and day out preach and, and uh, you know, be prepared. That's what we really try to pride ourselves on is uh, the preparation part and I think that that message has been sent very strongly by our manager Jim Riggleman you know he's uh, put a plan in place that uh, every day we show up uh, we're doing fundamental work we're doing uh, all the routine stuff in baseball the, the things that happen every day we practice we talk about and we try to perfect and um, you know so uh, again his plan was to uh, one from the offensive guys is to uh, have, a, have a good solid offense where you do a little bit of everything you know we hit for a little bit of power we hit for a little bit of average you know we steal some bases team speed yeah I mean and uh, and we defend a field you know yeah. there's been a, a, an emphasis on making sure that uh, to be a complete offense it's also about defending the field so uh, and we've done a good job so far and we hope to continue to to, to work that way and work towards uh, uh, you know our goals as an organization well it's been a joy on this side to watch that and um, I'm watching the dugout uh, and I know how far you are. I remember you jumping over that rail when they uh, yelled at one of your hitters. And uh, but how often uh, do the players come to you after an at bat and uh, maybe go over that bat or, or talk to you about uh, what they what you see? Yeah, it, it happens fairly regularly. You know, um, sometimes they'll they'll talk about pitch sequencing. They'll talk about locations. You know, we'll talk about just you know, anything that they they see or feel or anything that I see or something that's churned in my gut you know I have a I have an instinct on the inside that um, when it when it comes out pretty strong I, I grab the player and we, we get to talking but communications huge for me right. I really believe in a, in a, in a good you know uh, two-way street when it comes to communication I want them to be able to talk to me about anything and the same with me and so uh, to me that starts way before the game even starts well, Rick continued success man we're very fortunate to have you in this organization buddy thank you tremendously hard worker back up thank to you Byron Thank you.